Today I'm at Newborough Forest on Anglesey, which is managed by Natural Resources Wales. As you can see, there's plenty of disabled parking and behind me there are disabled toilets. We're going on a five mile walk today, so let's go check to see what it's like. At the start of the walk there's this viewpoint and you can see across the bay but you have to be aware that the pass can get covered in quite deep sand. The five mile walk that we're doing today is basically the Bike Quest Trail which is waymarked throughout the forest. Just over half a mile into the walk, you come to a junction where the actual route turns right. But if you go left down this way, there's a fantastic viewpoint. This viewpoint is a little bit off the trail but just look at those views, it's so worth it. From the viewpoint, you can head back to the car park, which will give you about a mile and a half out and back route. But we're gonna continue following the Bike Quest Trail, which leads us up there. Sand from the dunes can get blown onto the main track and some people may require assistance with these sections. When you come to Newborough Forest, it's a really good idea to bring some binoculars with you, just in case you're lucky enough to see a red squirrel. Just over three and a half miles into the walk, you'll come to this sign where the Corsica route carries straight on and the Bike Quest route turns to the right. You want to follow this route, the Bike Quest route. Once the Corsica and Bike Quest trail split, there's quite a long uphill gradient and some people may require assistance with it. When you come to the road, turn right and follow it back to the main car park. I'm almost at the end of this walk now and what a way to finish. Just look at those mountains, absolutely beautiful. <laughs> 